it for me. <laughs> I will not. I do, sir. And you will see why at the end of this. All right. How did I suck at Facebook in 2019? Uh, my, my, my goal in life is to end the spinning wheels, the wasted time, the wasted money, the wasted energy. Every single uh, online it, entrepreneurs are the most targeted buyer people thing. I can't, I can't even Facebook advertise to you guys because it's so competitive, okay? And it is it, it kills me that uh, 97% of it sucks and wastes your money. And if you put any time in what most people teach, you will waste all of your time and your energy. And that's my big, 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 big passion is to eliminate the spinning wheels uh, to help you whenever you only have three hours a week, make sure that you're getting a return on that time because that's crazy valuable. And so that, that's my passion. Um, the absolute formula, formula, formula for success in networking, success in Facebook, success in email marketing, success in your kid raising, <laughs> all right, is give, 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 ask, okay? Every single business gets this wrong on social media. Very, very few get it right. And it's always, buy my new thing, buy my thing, come to my event, come to, it's always me, 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 okay? Um, it is not what's in it for them. And that whenever, you, if, if we stopped right here, okay? And all you did was shift this one thing, this I'm going to help my avatar, all right? My best customer, help their day, enhance their day, come alongside their life. Today, right now, what are they going through? All right, and I help that. If you only make that shift, you will win as best as you can in Facebook 2019. Does everybody understand? Mm -hmm. Okay, it is, I think I put the slide in a different place. Uh, it's social media, not sales media, right? <laughs> okay. How to get on attention on Facebook. I put this one on here on purpose. I told myself I'd be productive today. The fact you're reading this right now I determined that was a lie. Okay, this is a big deal because um, Facebook wants to keep people on their platform. That's how they make money. That's how they show more ads. So you as entrepreneurs, man, how many times you go and you make a post and then you're like, sucked in and 40 minutes later you lift your head up and you're like oh how did I get here I watched a whale burning yes. video I watched yes. you know whatever all right so it, it so what what you are doing on Facebook to your customers is getting attention okay and what Facebook is doing is getting attention from you all right so very, very important as an entrepreneur. I have, I go back and forth. I delete Facebook off my phone. I put it back on. I delete it, put it back on, okay? Um, because, anyways, but I wanted to just tell you, just to make you aware that time, 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 control your time, control your day, direct your day, direct your life, okay? And Facebook wants you to drift because they want to show you more advertisements to make more money off of you. You follow me? Okay, so what we want our customers to do is waste time on our stuff, <laughs> all right? And what Facebook wants you to do is waste time on their stuff, but you gotta fight for your time. So, memes, we already showed one, there's one, what does this one say? Oh yeah, that's right. Entrepreneurs is a good one. You have a 40 hour work week, question mark? I remember my first part time job. <laughs> all right, memes, get attention on Facebook, memes distract me and you, right? and they distract, they bring attention to you, your business. It's a gift. Video is, okay, until, Dina, glad you're here. AI, right? It's the, it's the future. But until AI, this is the answer, video is the king of attention. It engages your, your mind, your visual, your audio, it engages everything, okay? 
And so video, video, video. If you're not putting videos on Facebook, don't even waste your time posting on Facebook. Seriously. Uh, Facebook stories. This was mine this morning. Um, I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, Charity. She's my my sister-in-law. So Aaron Sanders and Gladys, both of them sell stuff. Both of them sell services. Both of them sell products. And they were on the top of my Facebook page this morning, all right, because they populated to their story within the last, well, one was 10 hours ago, one was an hour ago. Facebook stories is, gets you up there. All right. It's stories like um, the stories that you put on other social media platforms where they go out and go away after so many hours. Absolutely right. They they die in 24 hours. Okay. Yep, absolutely right. So Facebook stories, super, super powerful. Got to know them. Facebook Live. Dina, how successful was your Facebook Live from yesterday? Well, um, on the networking Southwest Missouri groups, there was a lot of shares. On Davis Electric page, there was 17 shares, and then we got 20 more likes in just in just a few hours on the page. And then on my own personal, there was a couple of shares. So yeah, it was very somebody successful. shared it off of my share. Yeah, yeah. Fa yeah. Facebook lives, well, and what the content was freaking awesome. It's like, hey. I want to give someone sixty thousand dollars a year and improve their life. <laughs> I mean, that, that's a pretty awesome video, but it's because it was a Facebook Live. If it was a meme, it would not have had the reach. If it was a regular video, it probably would not have had the reach. That Facebook Live is just crazy, crazy powerful. And and my boss was in St. Louis and had no idea I did it. And like ten minutes after Josh left my office, um, I said. The, um, I did a Facebook Live on our Facebook page, and it kind of went a little viral. It's pretty cool. And he goes, yeah, I already heard about it. <laughs> I was like, okay, wow. from who? And he said, Michelle, which works in his fiance that works in um, Hollister for an explosive company. So anyway. Yeah, it's, it's, it's powerful. <clears throat> All right, so I already said that Facebook is social media, not sales media, okay? So if you do not engage in social, if you do not give, if you don't reply to every comment, you lose, all right? It's social, it's social media, okay? If you leave your followers behind, you get left behind. If I call you, call you, call you, you don't ever call me back, most people will quit, okay? Some people have the steadfastness to keep calling, the desperation to keep calling, maybe. <laughs> but social media, they're just gonna move on, all right? Reply to every comment, absolutely, reply to every comment. Um, super important, Facebook organic page reach is virtually dead, okay? Uh, the only things that really work are these things, the memes, the video, the Facebook stories, and the Facebook lives, okay? So do not anymore curate content. What curated content is, is a blog written by somebody else, okay? And share that on your Facebook page. Don't do it anymore, okay? It does have, there are exceptions to this, so, but I would say, more absolute than not, don't share other people's website links, okay? Because the give, 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 ask thing, I kind of, I didn't really say this hard, so glad this is coming about. So the give, 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 ask, Facebook gets money whenever people stay on Facebook, right? That's how they make money. Facebook loses money when people go off of Facebook, right? So Facebook's goal is to keep people on Facebook. So you are fighting Facebook's primary goal and and getting website to someone else's getting traffic to someone else's website okay yeah it might help man actually record a video say hey I just read these three things you can check it out if you want at blah 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 uh, the first thing was Facebook page is dead all right so make a video about the blog that you read that you loved you follow me because you your website your funnel, your opt-in pages, your products on your e-commerce store, whatever it is you're doing, you only want to come against Facebook whenever it absolutely helps you because they don't want people to come on Facebook, 
Okay? You got to give, 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 ask to your clients and customers, and you have to give, 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 ask to Facebook. I had a come to Jesus moment this morning, and I, I'm scared to really show you the numbers. But I got to do it because we have to end the spinning wheels. Get realistic about Facebook engagement. Gary Vaynerchuk, anybody heard of him? Okay. Can you, he is the, 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 the digital marketer of our time. Okay. If you ever want to learn anything about how to do LinkedIn, how to do Facebook, how to do Instagram, how to do YouTube, go to Gary B and just write out what he's doing. I mean, that's, that's literally the thing. He has, I have no idea what his budget is. I would, I would assume it's 30 to 50,000 a month on social media. It might even be two to three X that. So Gary V, he has 3.2 million likes. All right. Can me or you ever get there? Yes. I uh, know. <laughs> Can me or you ever do a video with Jewel? Oh, no. Okay. No? Probably not. Probably not. A video with Jewel. Look at how successful this thing is. 223 likes, 11 comments, 62 <laughs> shares, 868,000 views. If you guys had a video that did that, how excited would you be? Right? That'd be freaking awesome. But what are the numbers? What's the percentage? Whoa, Whoa is absolutely right. Whoa. 3.2 million people with 11 comments. If you got 11 comments, man, you're you're lit. 11 comments, 3.2 million people. 0.0003% of his followers commented. Worth your time and energy? Shares, 0.0019%. Views, 27%. That's pretty awesome. I think that Facebook counts a view if you scroll past it and it, and it pops for one second. I really do. And actually, two, three months ago, they got sued for inflating views on paid advertisements. Okay. So, but even if it's half wrong, that's still 10 or 12%. That's great. Okay. Engagement. 0.0007%. I love you. I love you. I care. That's why I had to share this. Okay? I do not want you to waste time and energy. Hey, local business owner, I'm not saying abandon your Facebook page altogether. I am saying do one of these four things make a meme, post to your story, make post a video or do a Facebook live, get in, do your thing, get out. Facebook wants to steal your time. Facebook wants to make money off of you and me and everybody else. That's their whole goal. And you got to fight for your time. So do one of these four things every once in a while, share a link, a post to um, a link to your e-commerce store, your products, your services, your blog that you wrote. Okay. The rest of this is about who should focus more on Facebook and who should focus less on Facebook so that you know for your business if you need to spend a little more time than the other businesses. Hope this helped you. I want to help you crush your business, crush your life. Preferable Life is the name. Hit subscribe. Leave me a comment below if this helped you out. Love to hear. Check out the rest of this. And I'll catch you on the next one. Who should spend time marketing on Facebook? The question to ask if Facebook is for your business is, am I a need or am I a want? Okay. Example. Need. I need a plumber. I need an electrician. I need blah, blah, blah. Okay. Am I going to, if I, likely none of us have a plumbing issue today. So this plumber post is going to do nothing for my day, right? But I have a daughter, then that's a cute girl with a shiny bracelet. 
You follow me? That's a want. That has likelihood of Facebook engagement. Big time. All right? The plumber does not. Right? So need or want is the number one, number one question on should I. A candle, want, good for you. Oil, I'd say probably flowers, candles. And that's probably about it. <laughs> right? To spend time and energy on Facebook. So, absolutely, pay nobody. Do not pay anybody. Never, never pay anybody. Don't waste your money on Facebook social media marketing. Do not, do not, do not, do not pay a person, an agency, to do Facebook for you. You hear me? It is not worth it. The ROI of that money is not going to return because of the deadness of Facebook page. You hear me? Don't pay anybody. Keep your page fresh enough. I think that a, a Facebook page is a brand validator, primarily. So just like a website homepage, we need to look legit, we need to look real, we need to look like we're here to stay for a long time. I think that is the only thing that matters right now that is an absolute. You have to have a Facebook page. It has to have a couple posts a week, okay, to look like a legitimate real business that's engaged, all right? And if you, you can't even find my Facebook page, that's how much I do not think that it's worth it. Okay. I got tagged once, someone made a, made a thing, was like, who's a good website builder? I, someone tagged my pa Facebook page. It was the only time that I was like, damn it. I should have at least stuck a picture out there. <laughs> because it literally has nothing. So, uh, enhance your audience's day. Give, 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 give. Ask. And that's how you don't make Facebook suck in 2019. That's why I didn't name this How to Kill Facebook in 2019, because you can't. You can only not suck at it. That's really all you can do. You can kill Instagram. Instagram is where you need to spend your time and energy. You can kill YouTube. You can kill a blog. You can kill podcasting. But you can't kill Facebook in 2019. You can only not suck at it. <laughs> yes, ma'am.